determination of transport number already in previous learning you know that the definition for transport number and we have discussed in that video the hitorf method one of the method to determine transport number of given electrolyte now in this video we are going to discuss about moving boundary method this is the schematic representation of the apparatus used in determination of transport number by moving boundary method here let us see the labeling regarding the instrumentation this method is based on the direct observation of migration of ions in an electric field in this experiment hcl is the principal electrolyte and cdcl2 means cadmium chloride serves as the indicator electrolyte to enable formation of a boundary the moving boundary method this is the experimental procedure the concentration of the solution are to are so adjusted that hydrochloric acid floats over cadmium chloride since hcl is lighter than the cadmium chloride solution because the density of hcl solution is less than the density of cadmium chloride solution a sharp boundary appears between the two solutions the mobility of cadmium ions is less than that of hydrogen ions it has a common ion with hydrochloric acid repeating again the mobility of cadmium ions is less than that of hydrogen ions and it has a common ion with hydrochloric acid let us see what is common ion the same ion present in the two compounds is said to be common ion in hcl there is cl minus ion in cadmium chloride also there is cl minus ion so we can say that there is common ion the anode is a stick of cadmium metal inserted at the bottom while the cathode at the top is platinum foil it is very important anode placed at the bottom and the cathode placed at the top when small current is made to flow through the conductivity cell the anions move towards anode while cations moves towards cathode the boundary spacing can be identified based on the marking in the instrument the number of gram equivalents of h plus ions can be calculated at the cathode the anode also the anode concentration also can be do by following the same procedure thank you happy learning